All right, here we go. Uh, let's take a look a little bit at your setup. I thought you guys did a very nice job when we first got out. Um, your setup looked really good. The pictures uh, from behind that um, Jackson took um, looked really good. So the, the, all the setup was good. I, you, met, you marked your main sheet. You can see here your booms just above center line, just a little bit. It's really perfect, and I thought the jib setup right here was good with the halyard and uh, and the setup. So this is on. I think this is just getting out there a little bit. Let's watch your tack here. There's Jackson going by with the, I think with the uh, the pin end of the thing. So let's watch, let's watch this tack here. Good. Everybody's lured. Mark comes up. First one to come up. There you go. Main sheet might be there. You go. Really hard. Light air. We wouldn't race in these conditions. I mean, it's just, it was just, just too much, too soft. Watch this tack. So again, Mark, always looking at the telltales, never looking behind you. Your tactician has to call and be looking around. See, now the boat's not going fast. So really trying to stay focused on the telltales 100% of the time and just having the other, other, uh, your team in the boat decide when you're going to tack and and make those calls for you so you don't have to be looking around you're looking at the boat your your job is just to make the boat go fast whichever direction they tell you to go travel up a little bit get traveler all the way up in the slight air immediately you're still way far down there you go Weight management attack tacks were good. Let's watch this tack again. And then we'll get in the starts. That's us right here. 200 you guys. Traveler should be all the way up already. All the way. In the light air, we talked, just get it all the way up to the top. Still not up yet, right? Got to get the traveler all the way up here. Tip trim again looks looks good from here. There we go. Let's watch the set here. Here's your set. Good hand, really good hand, shoulder, get more strength in your shoulder. Or bam, ease the jib sheets, get the jib loose, pull a little bit more on the spin sheet. Or bam, nice easy furl. Really nice job there. Good set. Very good set. Let's watch the jibe here. Nice ease as much as you can, the rotation. A little more weight movement, a lot more. You guys both, you got to get all the way over. A lot more weight movement there um, to help on the roll. Top batten, make sure it's all good. It's not good right yet. Got to pop the top batten through. But don't let it be the driver. Driver's got to stay focused. Somebody else in the boat needs to manage it. So Mark just got to stay focused at the right angle for the pressure and um, not looking around as much. All right, so that's, uh, let's look at the next one. Okay. Coming in, I think this was just a regular kind of douse, nothing fancy here. Let's watch this jive here. Yeah, you, got, you guys got to roll the boat, right? Got to roll the boat. A lot more weight movement there, and that'll help with the main. That just helps with everything. So, got to work on the jibe weight weight management a little bit more. Let's watch this one.
That's better. That's better. Yeah, one little snap on the perfect. That was really good. Just, to, again, be aggressive with the weight management. Nice job there. Better. Better than the last job. Let me come in here. Oh, let's, let's, let's see. Let's see. Let me just go. Yep. Let's watch this. Good. Yeah, that's what you guys are looking for. Nice job. Okay, now I think we try to get ready for the first start here. This is the first one, right? Coming in. See if I turn on the sound. Just really behind. You can see how far. Yeah, a little bit over. He's right. Just... Well, now you're way too loose. So again, it's minuscule movements. Now the jib's way too loose. I mean, it's yeah. Traveler's not all the way up. Always preset that. Yeah, that was practice start, so all right, we'll get through that one. Let's find the next one. This is the one, yeah, let's watch this one here, okay. So this was just a matter of being a little late. And now you got to get going and get up on the line a little bit here, right? Got a boat to win, a little view, but we roll. That main's got to be in. You got to be going here. And Mark's sitting on the leeward side. He's got to always be sitting on the leeward side as you would normally. Um, you know, treat it as you would sail the boat normally, okay? With everybody's weight to leeward. Now you're getting rolled. So just coming out of that tack and if you guys did a normal tack and normal things and accelerated the boat you would have been in much better shape there so we'll get through that All right now the next start was really bad you got held out at the at the top of the line um, so this start really wasn't very good at all wait a minute oh, could be wrong here am I wrong Let's see what happens here. Or was this one really late? Yeah, this one's really late. Everybody's already up in the line. And just really, really late. Got to be up with... See, all these boats are ahead of you, so you're trying to catch up. You're sailing through the bad air. And just going to be super late. And there you go, right? And now we're racing. Now you're better. You're going to have to tack out here. So, just a matter of when you come in and on port, and we'll, we'll talk a little bit more about it tomorrow uh, when we go through it. Back to the starting line again. This is the one you got held out on. Yeah, that's the one. Here's the start boat. You're going to have to circle out, just held way above the ley line. So we'll talk a little bit about a starting routine. Obviously, each start's been significantly different. So uh, we'll, we'll go through that a little bit. And off we go, right? Looking for an exit now. Main 
is really far out right now. I know. Oh, you're ducking, ducking about. That's why. Okay. Get your mark. You have your marks. It. All you need to do, right? Get comfortable where it is. Jib's almost in. Still out a little bit. A little bit more jib trim. A little bit more jib trim. Try to find those marks. All right, let's go look at the set, see how that worked out. Here we go. Remember, there you go. Get the jib sheets off ASAP. Not a bad job at all, actually. But the weight, there was no weight movement from the front two guys, right? You gotta use your weight, guys. It really helps out. Got to sit down, Mark. Can't stand up downwind, right? Just got to be sitting down. Sitting down to windward. Let's watch this jibe. Float on this on the kite. No, Jim two not moving your weight. Ever there's no weight. Jim one's going the wrong side. So again, got to use your weight. The main didn't flop over because there wasn't enough weight movement in helping that. So really help the rolls here. Let's watch the douse. Okay, here we go. Nice job on the bow work. Well done. That's the technique. Just keep working on it. Work. It'll it'll work well. Okay. There you go. So let's let's chat tomorrow on a few things and um, continue to work on it.